Hey YouTube, a quick update on my new bio pellet reactor. It's a Reef Dynamics uh, reactor. It's a recirculating one. Just got it set up probably about four days ago. Um, so far, I'm very happy with it. Haven't run into any issues, no leaks. Um, I do understand that they're not making them anymore, but I think this design is going to be around for many, many years. And the only thing that would ever need to be really replaced would be the pump, and it's an Eheim pump. So, I see myself having this for years to come. Uh, read great reviews on it, watched some videos from Reef Dynamics. Uh, so, we'll see how it goes. Pretty hopeful. Didn't have much more room anywhere else to put it down here. So, I decided to put it right there in the front. It does fit. The panel closes. And I think I can get to it for easy maintenance. Um, it can go in the sump. But I decided not to. It came with some fittings so that you can put it in the sump. I have the output right there in front of the protein skimmer intake. Um, I think that's close enough. But that's pretty much it. Just get putting out an update uh, on the Reef Dynamics bio pellet reactor. Maybe in two weeks I'll do a follow up. Right now my nitrates are around 25 parts per million. 30 sometimes so we'll see in a few weeks I did use my uh, uh, bio pellets from another reactor in here so these are not like fresh bio pellets and I added an extra cup so hopefully they will seed and give me a jump start into the whole process if you guys have any comments suggestions or feedback please leave them below appreciate it